There is a message from National Treasures. Please check it. Floating, floating underneath the azure sky. In a shower of flowers, the rippling colours fly. Such was our ascending, and such was our dance. I was born by the Ganges, raised by moist monsoons and fertile soil. My body grew to the fullness of sensuality. We enjoy each other's company, hanging by the deities and the Buddha. In pervading fragrance, we play the music as wonderfully as we dance. Carried by monsoon, I glided towards the northern sky, where there was infinity of space. I came across an angel with wings. Together we travelled to the east, where we met a feathered being who journeyed westward, our spirits enriched by wisdom of the Orient. We flew across plateaus and deserts, till finally we reached a swathe of magical precipices. Into the caves we flew, dwelling in the Buddha's paradise. Countless of my kind became one entity in these caves to be known as the Morgo Grottoes, the birth of which we witnessed. In this nirvana we serve the Buddha with flowers, music and dance. Using the exquisite brush strokes of our new home, the artisans painted us, depicted the hair lace and tiara we brought from our homeland by the Ganges. In a U-shape posture, we are trying to defy gravity, our half-naked bodies vivid and plump. Accompanied by flowers, our flesh frolicked with ribbons flying about. Some 100 years later, Camels brought flame from the west. Pure and fierce, the flame shifts into a million shapes, encountering and inspiring the wisdom of the Middle Kingdom. And the glow was cast upon us, revealing the mountainous layers of our skirts. Our dancing figures, growing comelier and slenderer, showed no sign of stopping till we danced into the Sui, a dynasty that was spectacular yet transient. For over three decades, some 70 new grottos were carved into the precipices, all adorned with our dance. Sometimes we were a singing parade, following where the flame went, grazing the rolling clouds. Sometimes we guided the celestial beings arousing a fleeting gale, intricate and vibrant. Then we flew into a sea of translucent azure, perhaps the azurite extracted from blue copper, but also, in a larger sense, the infinite freedom of our playful playfulness. Gracefully, we strolled through gardens, meadows, pavilions and terraces. Who needs cloud or wind or fire? or even wings, when the overlapping and flowing of lines and spaces were sufficient for tracing our flight. Over 1,650 years, 270 grottos and 4,500 figures dances and music from all the realms of heaven, a million variations of our being, riding on the wind of change, depicted grandeur in minute details. Singing and dancing, our enchanting grace is life itself, and our ethereal soar marks the sky. <laughs> 